Hey everyone, welcome to my studio. I have a new substrate, it is this box. The box is not quite square. I think it measures about nine inches this way and a little less than nine that way. It has a lovely hinge. I like the feel of how it opens and shuts. And I've already scratched up the top surface with sandpaper and drawn a few reference lines just to keep me on center. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna do, but I think my palette is going to be, this is gonna be the centerpiece. And then I'm gonna use some browns and some few beads, maybe some of these colors. Tiles, I've got some flowers. And I'm not sure what else. I'm just gonna have fun with it. I'm just gonna use Weld Bond. bothering me. I think I'm going to make it symmetrical.
into this project that this is a very established palette, but I do think that I need one more material to finish it off. And so I pulled out some Smalty here. And I first looked at this one, which coordinates with that aqua color. And then I looked at this one. And I actually think I'm gonna go with the lighter one because this one is too close to the glass, mirror glass. And this one gives some nice contrast with that light color. So I'll be adding this small tea in. grout this piece and I've mixed up some regular um, sanded grout in black it's slaking right now as soon as it's ready I will grout it but I want to show this mosaic up close before I begin I do have some different heights especially the small tea is sticking way up so I am giving myself plenty of time so that I can clean up around some of these taller pieces and get in there anyway I'll be starting in just a second this project I'm going to open it up and line it with some paper so knowing that this is what's on the outside I have selected this shiny copper paper and this is a coordinating paper that went with it it's just scrapbooking paper that I already had from my days of scrapbooking 
to put it in there, I'm gonna put Weld Bond in there to hold it, but then to make it nice and smooth, I am going to smear it all around and have an even coat. So this one goes here, Let's make sure it fits. It fits perfectly. Just fair warning, I am a professional Weld Bond Wrangler, and it's been a minute since I used this Weld Bond. So it is clogged up in here. The skin on the top, clogs the cap and I'm having issues. So just bear with me. I do manage to get it all over and I'm able to clean it up so it's fine. just take a wet wipe and wipe off the excess because I don't want it to dry there it'll turn all shiny and discolor it together. Thanks for watching. See you next time.